Welcome everybody to the Ugly Couch. I am your host, Johnny Carlson. And I have a feeling that tonight will be a great show. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling fresh. The holidays are coming up. And with that, the end of the semester. As we get close to the finals, residence halls will be implementing a 24-hour quiet hour. Area coordinators also remind students that there will be a continued zero tolerance policy for alcohol and that the residence advisors will be on the lookout for any suspicious activity. Said the freshman walking into Beckman with jingling backpack, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just coming from the library. <laughs> As James Shammy, a 21-year-old digital marketer out of England, has created a revolutionary app. I'm not kidding. This is huge. He's created the hashtag card block that completely blocks out all mentions of the Kardashians. Over 20,000 people have signed up for the app, which is still in beta testing. How great that app would be for the holidays when your family starts asking about your dating life over the holidays. Do you have a girlfriend? Not today, Aunt Carol. I am not in the mood. <laughs> students will be heading home for the holidays soon. Mothers everywhere are preparing for enough loads of laundry to single-handedly keep tied in business. <laughs> no, my mom never did do my laundry. In fact, she put me to work when I got home for the holidays. You know, they say on cold nights leading up to the holidays, you can hear my mother screaming, I will return all your gifts if I don't get any help around this house. <laughs> We all know my mother's favorite Christmas tradition is threatening to cancel Christmas. <laughs> all right, don't go anywhere. We have a great show coming up. Nadir Morgan will be joining us. Stick around. We'll be right back. Welcome back to the show, The Ugly Couch. Again, I am your host, Johnny Carlson. With us here, we have our guest, freshman Nadir Morgan. Nadir, how are you doing today? I'm good. I'm good. How are you? I'm, I'm doing pretty well. We all, some may know that you are from California. Talk yes, about I the am. transition there. What do you, how you, what, what's going on? Um... I mean, it's cool, yeah. I'm from uh, the Bay Area, basically, uh, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, it's, it's kind of like a culture adjustment, but in terms of, like, like weather and stuff, I'm dressing pretty cool. It was kind of windy the other day, you know. I, I, I didn't know how I was going to do it, but it was kind of windy. <laughs> yeah. It gets a little cold over here. Oh, yeah. I, and I, when they said the word tornado watch, I was like... <laughs> no tornadoes by you? But, <laughs> tornadoes? Really? You know, got yeah. earthquakes though. Oh yeah, earthquakes not even that bad though. Like an earthquake, it'll just go <clears throat> for like two seconds and it's over, and everybody just starts screaming. But like, I was just chilling. My first earthquake happened when I was on the toilet. Wow. Must have you come out early, huh? They come out, man. Right? Huh? Were you going number two? Oh yeah. Yeah, you were. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Good. All right. Um, you play volleyball, correct? Yes, sir. Yeah. How how's that season? I know the season's not till spring, correct? Yeah. You guys doing the well, workouts? January. Or? January. Okay, We're in so preseason winter. right now, so we have uh, our preseason play date, play date uh, at Carthage on Saturday. So that should be fun. Play and a few teams? And play a couple teams, you know, show them what Laura's Volleyball is about. There you go. What position do you play? I'm middle. Middle? Yeah. All right, so you bump it? No. You set it? I'm that dude that, like, spikes it. Spike, you spike it on Yeah. Oh, All yeah. All right. Tall guy. What are you, six? Six, six. Six, six. Yeah. Nice. It's big advantage. Well, six five and a half without shoes. Six five and a half without shoes. Good advantage for the game of volleyball. Um, do you have any other hobbies with playing uh, volleyball? I know some may know you do music. Yeah. Tell us a little more about that. Um, basically, when I moved to, well, it was before, cause um, before I used to live in Jamaica with my dad. My dad's from there, so um, my dad was a DJ, and so he like kind of put me around music first. And so when I got to Cali, it's kind of like where it kind of like showed and like kind of, I guess, blossomed. Um, I met a couple rappers uh, by the names of like I Am Sue and Save Gemini. And they kind of like made me want to pursue music even more. So, yeah. We got a fun game coming up it's called Reese's Roulette. We will be right back with that. What you working on? Uh, my That's fun. All 
right, we are back here again with our guest, Nadir Morgan. We are going to play a game. <sighs> this game is called Reese's Roulette. Now, what we have here is we have nine cups set up. Hit, hiding underneath them are little Reese's cups wrapped in golden paper. Now, four of them have cheese filling, while the other five have actually Reese's peanut butter filling. And what we're going to do is we're going to mix these cups up. We're going to take turns. When, I, when you pick up a cup, you got to eat it. First one to eat two cheeses is the loser. So here we go. We're going to Don't lie. <laughs> we're going to go with the President Jim Collins cup, right? We're going to lift it up. Here we go. Oh, here we go. I'm not even going to look at it. I'm just going to put it in my mouth. That's peanut butter. Wow. Phenomenal. That's a great peanut butter cup. Now? Bro, see, you gotta be gutsy. What? Boy. Unwrap it and eat it. That's peanut butter. Peanut butter. Alrighty. Nobody has yet to eat a cheese cup. Peanut butter. Aww. It's peanut butter. All right. Go ahead. Any, mini, miny, mo. Catch the tiger by his toe. If he holler, let him go. My mama told me to pick this one because this one is the best. Oh, f I already know it's going to be cheesy. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh, Mama, I love you. <laughs> wow. That's definitely peanut butter. Okay. All right, got your mad on for no reason. Oh, yeah, eat that, baby. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. Oh, that got cheese in it. Oh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> That's disgusting. That is honestly the grossest combination. Cracker cheese whiz and chocolate. No. Mm -mm. Go ahead. Mm. My grandpa do. He Jewish. <laughs> they have, they've been like nice cheese. Like the expensive ones, like the ones with the like aged really, ones. No, like with the really fancy names, like fettuccine or papulalimi or some stuff. Ratatouille. <laughs> Your boy's nice. Your boy's nice. I'm nice. That's no cheese for me. Well, I have one chance. If I get the cheese, I lose. Nadir wins without having to eat a cheese. You Hold this L. That's the cheese. Take this L. It's actually peanut butter. Ow! <laughs> peanut butter and chocolate. Wow. We got two left. We got two left. One of them has... I think one of them has cheese. So I pick? You could either be the loser or you could either be... No. Have you eaten the cheese one? Nope. Nope. So either we gonna tie or I'm gonna win. Oh! <laughs> I my grandma. Well, we take the last ones to me. Oh, that cheese, baby. Seems to me as I have, am going to eat two Reese's cheese cups. And that is disgusting. You want some Santa Lagina to wash it down? That's right. Oh my goodness. I'm telling you, fancy water makes it taste better. Well, my dear, it was a pleasure having you on the set. Pleasure having you on the show. Thank you for risking your taste buds. Oh, yeah. It was a fun time. Oh, yeah. Hopefully, we have some of your music coming out soon. Oh, yeah. Good luck in volleyball this season, and we'll, uh, we'll see you next week. Thank you. Bye, America. <laughs>